If you are playing in Random Squad, I recommend that you take the Valve first so that someone else doesn't take it in front of you and hinder your progress. Now in the cemetery, we'll wait for the NPC called Groundskeeper. He takes a few minutes to spawn. Pay attention, because he looks like the other zombies. I only realized it was him because I took the key. Now that you have the toolshed key, open the shad to obtain the key item called Handbrake. Alright Ripple, let's see what you've been keeping locked up in here. With the valve you obtained in the first step of the guide, go to the bowling alley and use it to obtain water pressure gauge. If you're playing solo, you'll need a few grenades and rockets to kill the zombies as quickly as possible to complete the valve's progress without receiving unwanted attacks. The water pressure gauge will drop on the floor after finish the progress bar. I caught it very quickly, but I'll put it in slow motion for you. We need to unlock the tech store. To do this use 1250 scraps to buy the mangler cannon on the craft table. An alternative way to break down the tech store door is to use the elite attack called mangler. Two of those sexist pigs are thinking too about girl power if I have this back in uni.